another video? Is it a uh, vlog day? Yeah, it's vlog day. You know what I'm like? Good morning, people. We're back doing another video again. I appreciate you guys uh, for the Patreon subscribers. I appreciate you for hitting that subscribe and like button. That does help the channel greatly. We're back here doing another video with the ski. We're gonna see what is going on with this equipment. It has a little bit of bogging, so I spoke to Julio. He said he believes that probably water got in it, which I'm pretty sure it did, and that it fouled the spark plugs. I'm sorry about my uh, hair. Just woke up, but we got some spark plugs here. We're gonna slap that in, take it for a test drive, and then we'll see what that comes out of. But I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys checked out on the link or at the end of the video, you guys are gonna see the Patreons account. If you can, please help the channel by subscribing on there. If not, least you can do, hit that subscribe button and that like. I appreciate it. Make sure you comment too, that always helps. You know, I always like to interact with you guys and I try to respond as best as I can. All right, stay tuned. But first we gotta get to the ski, so. I got my garage looking like a mess today. So start moving some things out and we'll take it from there. Voila. All right, so we got the spark plugs removed and this is what we got. Mind you, these spark plugs only have one day of writing, and that's what it looks like. Let's check the other two out. There it is. And then the last one. This is what is believed to be causing the issue, and we will see. Well, let's see what the new ones look like. And these are yep, the same ones, the NGK R4339. And here's the difference between the new one and the old one. <laughs> Everything's in there, everything's ready to go. All we gotta do is give it a test drive and see how it runs. If not, we're gonna take it back to Julio, see if he can figure it out. So first, we gotta remove all that in front. Let's go. Today, we got the strap on the chest. We're not doing the head anymore because you guys uh, heard what happened last time. I lost my GoPro camera for having strapped to my head. So let's see what happened. We're back at our spot. We got a boat there. Wait for them to get out and then we'll go launch the ski. How you guys doing? Good. The water is pretty cold. Woo! Let's get it warmed up. All right, guys, we got that 81 again. 81. 81 miles per hour. Oh, that bogged down right there. All 
right, so we're on our way back now home. The ski is uh, doing similar things. I, I feel like it's doing a little bit less, and I feel because it's probably more cold. There was another boat there that was uh, getting ready to come into the ramp, so we had to cut it short. I wanted to do another like two runs to kind of see the difference. I noticed when I put the ski on launch control, as soon as it wants to hop out of the water, uh, where the launch control usually does this thing, it kills the engine and bogs down. So I'm gonna see if I can take it back to GP Racing, see if he could uh, see what's wrong with it. Um, and then we'll just take it from there. I don't think the spark plugs is actually the problem, to be honest with you. So I'm not sure if it's something in the program or what it is, but I'm pretty sure that GP knows what's wrong with it. So we'll figure it out. All right, stay tuned. <laughs>